Come with me for a quick walk around tour on this 1976 Magnum 38 Express Cruiser available at South Mountain Yachts. Starting off the forward bow here, we see we've got a very large fore deck. Great, just throw a few lounge pads out there and enjoy the sun. Coming down along the side, we see we've got a nice pilot house there with lots of windows, with windshield wipers, and the side windows open for ventilation so we can enjoy the sea air. Notice we also have a stainless steel arch for our radar and various antennas right there. Notice we also have a sunshade to protect our guests. That's removable, so when we want to fish or just enjoy the sun, we can. Here at the transom of rum, rum line, we get a, nice, a view of the nice colored hull, extra wide teak swim step with the boarding ladder, heavy duty stainless steel boarding ladder right there. This gives us a view of the cockpit. Notice we've got some in-deck rod holders, fuel tank right here, access on the other side also, and our hawse chutes for lines right there. Heavy duty stainless steel. Coming down along the side, here we have those wide open windows, shore power connection, and a wide walk around. Got some very nice sleek lines on this Magnum Express. She's a fast boat, looked good when she was built, and still holds her looks. Let's go aboard. Using dock steps, you can easily step here. We have an overview of the cockpit. Notice the wide open expansiveness of the cockpit. We've got the U-shaped seating, which is removable, but it's a great feature for lots of entertainment. Ladies like it because it's all one level, lots of room. Our table can remain in the raised position, and it can also be lowered for more of a cocktail table type of situation. Notice the deck is nice teak, pretty good condition. All the plugs are there, rubber's good. Circling around, we see we've got a couple fighting chairs for more seating. And guys, when you want to fish, remove the transom seat, bring those over, and cast away. Moving forward to the port, we see we have our helm seat right here. Swivel, high-low also. At the helm, we have our VHF radio, Morris shifter throttles right there, Bruno radar, generator control Got a large four inch compass, leather wrapped steering wheel. And this is a very nice touch. Chrome plated dash with all of our gauges right there. Engine hour meter showing about 304. The engines were replaced in the late 90s. Notice we don't have rocker switches. We've got the positive pull switches right here. Temperature gauge, docking lights, AM, FM, cassette player. Notice the view from the helm. Nice, wide, and open.
circling the starboard. We see we have a com dual companion seat, which is also removable and folds up. And behind that, we have a little storage area for air and ventilation. Another hatch in the hard top area. Tremendous cockpit. Let's go inside. We enter the cabin through the center line door and down a few steps. Right as we enter, to starboard, we see our booth style dinette. We even have the original manuals here. Some features I'm going to point out right up front. We've got very good upholstery. Notice the teak floor protection throughout the vessel. Do have some nice classic touches of wood throughout. Stainless steel port lights. There's seven of them all total in the vessel, plus two overhead hatches. Once inside, moving forward, we see we've got a nice little day galley, microwave right there. And some counter space for some food prep for our guests. A ladies like it feature on this boat is this extra large oversized V-berth with storage underneath. Off to port. We have a sleeper sofa with storage underneath. Moving aft. Again, another LLI feature is the size of the head number one. There is a sh shower and the vacuum flush head with the tank watch system, which keeps the vessel fresh and clean. This vessel is very well powered with twin U.S. Marine 454 engines. The hull is in excellent condition. Interior shows well. Great for family, friends, fishing. Overnight, she'll sleep for folks. Viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yacht.